Dunkin' Donuts iced tea is prepared by brewing tea leaves in heated water to release the flavor and nutrients. The quality and temperature of the water, along with the time to steep, are the key components in making the perfect cup of tea. This course demonstrates how to brew iced tea. The same process is used to brew iced green tea. The first step in brewing iced tea is to prepare the reservoir. The process to prepare the reservoir is the same for both iced tea and iced coffee. You are ready to make iced tea using the Bun Digital IC3 Brewer. Remember, the steps to make iced tea can be found in your job aids. Begin by using an empty prepared shuttle marked with the 24-hour shelf life for the liner. Using a clean container, add the appropriate amount of ice to the shuttle. Add 5 quarts of ice for a full batch and 2.5 quarts of ice for a half batch. This example shows a full batch. Next, add the lid and place the shuttle on the brewer under the spray head. Lay the tea bags flat in the green handled brew basket. Confirm that the display screen reads 200 degrees. Slide the brew basket into the brewer, making sure you push the brew basket all the way to the back without moving the tea bags. Use a shelf life label and mark the shelf life on the front fold of the liner. The shelf life for iced tea is 8 hours. The shelf life for the iced tea in the tap system only is 15 hours. The longer shelf life for the iced tea in taps is because the iced tea remains refrigerated for its entire shelf life. Select the appropriate batch size and then brew C, the iced tea button. When the brew cycle is complete, press the iced tea button again to dispense dilution water. Next, remove the lid and stir the iced tea four times using the designated iced tea spoon or long-handled rubber spatula to ensure that the tea and water are blended. Place the lid onto the shuttle. Remove the brew basket and discard the tea bags. Then rinse the brew basket and wipe down the spray head with a clean, damp, sanitized cloth to avoid any flavor transfers. The iced tea is now ready for serving. Insert the full, covered reservoir into the iced tea serving station or tap system. Be sure to monitor shelf life and discard any expired iced tea. Before you brew your first batch of iced tea, here are some important tips for brewing the perfect batch. Since the same brewer is used to brew iced coffee and iced tea, Using the green-handled brew basket and wiping down the spray head are important steps in the process. Coffee oils left over from the iced coffee brewing process can affect the flavor of the tea. So it's important to wipe down the spray head with a clean, sanitized cloth after each use. Lay the tea bags flat in the center of the green-handled brew basket. This slows the flow of tea going into the shuttle allowing the tea bags to steep in the hot water longer and develop a full flavor.